like what 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 was with this kind of chasing violent music you're supposed to be <laughs> and now for our feature presentation Hey everyone, Mix here, and welcome back to Seven Nights Ghost. Now, in the last episode, we had learned quite a few things about this spirit that is accompanying us during these seven days. Uh, for one, she is more of a pest than anything. I mean, I wouldn't consider her malevolent or sinister at all. In fact, I really wouldn't mind spending seven days with this spirit, you know, just as long as she doesn't touch my belongings and leaves my donuts alone. Um, another thing that we had learned is that the reason why she hasn't moved on, you know, taking that next step into heaven is that she has never actually had a handsome man before. And she made it quite clear that we're not it. But of course, you know, this is a bit of a dating sim. So I'm sure at the end, we are actually that person. Um, don't know why I'm hoping that we are, you know, we're really trying to move on here and help her move on So I don't know you guys, but uh, that's really all, all I can say You know, I don't have a proper segue for this next episode because it is the last we are on night five No night four no night five with two more days during this week and then that's it so we are going to end things with this episode so sad and hopefully we'll be able to help her pass on so let's not waste another minute and let's get to it my god what is it it's from the direction of the tv did she break the tv Uh, she, she, the audio is kind of wonky here. For a second there, I thought I completely lost, uh, audio. It's the kind of figurine displayed beside the TV. Uh-huh. Okay, so we need to put this together. Did she drop it? Its tail is broken off. It looks like she's in shock. But she doesn't like feeling guilty. I mean, too bad, you broke it. Repair of the cat figurine. Okay. So we're gonna need to find glue. Um, I'm, I'm trying to remember where everything is at. There's just so much that we need to uh, remember. Oh, well, why is it dark? Conveniently, there's a light on here. So what, the power's out? We're, we're adding a new layer of uh, fear here? <laughs> so we, we, we don't get a light now? Why are you being such a pest? Okay. <laughs> well, we got the pocket light. I had a feeling. I had a hunch. I was surprised. <laughs> I was surprised too. I mean, uh, why the game didn't mention that the... Um, the lights all of a sudden don't work. Uh, this is it's beyond me. But I'm gonna see if I could actually turn them on. Can I not turn on the light? I think she like hit all of the. Uh, all of the, uh, the, the lights. Yep. 
Yep, that doesn't work. Okay, so we need to find adhesive. Um, my guess is that it's going to be in the living room, but that is just a guess. Holy, don't get so close to me, please. Okay. Now I don't know which direction is she gonna come from there now okay she is good 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 just stay there <sighs> yes I found the first one not the tape is it no okay She's not making any noise anymore, you know, that little creepy wander. Is my light getting dark, dimmer? For a second there, I thought my light was getting dimmer. Okay. I think we're done in this room. Yeah, my light is getting dimmer. I hate that. I hate that a lot. Stop. Oh, I found another one of those, uh, what's it called? I think there's, they're like spells. Holy, too close. Okay, we're out of here. I don't think the adhesive would be in the kitchen, but it's kind of the last area where I haven't checked. I'm not entirely sure, but she might be actually stuck in the bathroom. Wouldn't be in here. Yes, I'll take that. All right, all right, so this is Sato. By the way, I found a small tube of something that fell in the gap between the washing machine and the wall. Wow, how, how would I have been able to figure that out if I had not received this text? Um, I didn't have time and left it there. It is probably trash, so if you can dispose of it, I would appreciate it, gladly, okay. So, by the washing machine, in, in the gap. There it is. Found it. Now I should be able to repair the damaged part. Now I just need a file or something for molding. I hope I can find it somewhere. I know exactly where that is. Unless 
the game is going to trick me once again. Wait, where did she come from? I swear she sounded like she came from the uh, bedroom. Yep. Why are you right there? Oh, okay, I got it. <laughs> I wanted to make sure that she was still on my peripheral. The glue got the tail to stick. All right. Now all I have to do is file away the glue that's sticking out and clean it up. All right. Not bad. Wait, what? Is she going to be around? I I I'm scared to do this now because... I don't know if there's going to be a queue or something. I think I'm okay. Okay, okay. Come on, dude. You can't do that. She's going to scare me. <gasps> no, 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 no. We're going to fail. We're going to fail, dude. Okay, okay. She switched directions. We come. Oh, come on. She's going to she's going to jump scare us. Oh, OK, she moved. She moved. I hate this. This is the most stressful part right here. Oh, I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. Okay, she's back in the kitchen. Yes, I did it. <laughs> that was so stressful. Holy crap. Can this day be done now? Repair is complete. I think it's stuck beautifully. Yeah, it's like uh, nothing happened to it. Holy. Is she trying to kill us? That was uncalled for. That scared me. <laughs> that actually got me right there. <laughs> what, 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 what was with this kind of chasing violent music? You're supposed to be. <laughs> Come on, man. How many of these jump scares are you going to give us, huh? She actually get us this time. <laughs> we fixed the cat. You have nothing to worry about. I repaired it because it looked repairable.
I'm sorry. Was it unnecessary? I thought she was about to jump scare us again. I don't know why she keeps on trying to be a pest with us, man. We're just trying to help. She was very happy. Good. That's a good thing. Okay. I do believe that is the end of night five. Yes? Good. <laughs> wow. All right. Night five accomplished. All right. Day six. The life here is nearly over. I was surprised to meet a roommate, but I've learned a lot about how to deal with her. However, according to the schedule, this room is scheduled to be demolished after two days. That's right. I'm a little concerned about what will happen to her after the, the demolition. Oh, she wrote a note? There's a key as well. Also, if you're hearing that buzzing noise, that's coming from the game and not from my microphone. I don't know why it does that. She's up to mischief again. Is she? She's messing with the lights. Find time of rest. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Are we going to be in the dark again? I would really like not to be in the dark again. Okay. Back in the dark. What does this say? A message from her. Unless you solve all the riddles, you'll be stuck in this room forever. By the light box. What? By the light box, grid lines indicate the keyhole. Follow the numbers and crush the squares from the mouth of the white porcelain emerging in a cloud of white smoke, a signpost pointing to the key. The key unlocks the door of impurity. The pair of sake cups show where it is. When the sake cups are set on the table, the world will regain its light and warmth and people will find the time to rest. What is this? This sounds like a very complicated puzzle. Or I guess a series of puzzles here. So by the light box, we'll go step by step here. By the light box, grid lines indicate the keyhole. Follow the numbers and crush the squares. Got a sticky note with a key drawn. Oh, go away. By the light box. That's not the thermostat. I don't even know where the light box is. Oh, Sato, thank you so much. Let me know what's up. Check the paper on the TV. Okay, I had a feeling that he was talking about the TV here. Fill in the squares and find the keyhole. Check the paper on the TV. Oh! Well, there it is. Oh, it's one of those again. Okay, so what was... What? What? What is this? Oh my god. I'm not going to figure this out.
Is it just tic-tac-toe-ish? Wait, wait, how do I erase? Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Find another place, please. Spawn another, spa spawn another area. Please spawn in another area. Yes! Wow. Okay, so that was a lot um, easier than I thought. What is this illustration? Fountain? I think I saw it in the restroom. Okay. Not this one? <gasps> Holy... That was the closest I think she's ever been. What? Water fountain. Hello, I'm in the restroom. Why isn't this working? Let's read a note once more. <sighs> okay, so we crush the squares from the mouth of the white porcelain emerging in a cloud of white smoke, a signpost pointing to the key. Oh. Okay. Moisten the stickies with steam. Huh? Am I doing this right? Oh, hot. <laughs> okay, so we found the key. I'm so confused. It said restroom. Uh, signpost pointing to the key. The key unlocks the door of impurity. Uh. What is this? A sticky note. Sticky notes with symbols drawn. How do I... Okay. I, I, I should have checked out the item list here. I didn't do that, but it looks like we have this note here, which, I, I mean, come on, Dev. You could make this a little bit simpler, you know, when finding these sticky notes, but... It looks like we do have another puzzle here. It's to get to the key. So we have a black square, lines F, TVF, black square. Black square, lines F. Okay. I don't even know what that means. I don't know what that means, you guys. Do we go back to that? Uh, no, it's disappeared now, hasn't it? Wait, what? 
What is this a fountain? I think I saw it in the restroom. That's another thing too. You said there's an illustration of that in the restroom. I didn't see that in here. Right? Nothing here. Okay, maybe they... Let's check this room again. Get off. Get out of here. What's up with this clock? It's got like a... Okay, that, that's nothing. <laughs> I thought that was a clue or a hint or something. Okay, so we're back here. An illustration of the fountain. What's this? Oh my gosh. Oh, I found it. I found it. I found it. I found it. I found it, guys. Okay, okay. Um, so let's get our item list again. So we have square line F, TVF square, square line F, TVF square, square line F, TVF square. I did it. Excellent. I swear I did not cheat, guys. And, uh, oh, we have another note. A sticky note is pasted. Something was painted on it. Take this. Yes, I will. I got the sticky note uh, with 39 written. 39. Let's check this out. Um, what the hell are those supposed to be? A sticky note with 39 written. All right, let's go um, observe around here. See if there's anything new. They kind of look like they look like those. And I see sticky notes on them immediately. 39. Oh, God, it's math. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we have two times. Uh, so it needs to equal to 39, right? Is that what it said? Okay, so it has to equal to 39. Go away, go away, I'm doing math. Uh, two times three, six, six, no, that ain't it. Two times seven. Oh. Oh, God. What did I do? So two times has to be the first one, right? You would think. Um, so... Let's go with the biggest uh, two times seven fourteen. Wait, that doesn't make any sense. There's no, a, a, huh? Two times what? Minus. This game is too tough. You know, it, it doesn't give us like the exact amount of information to proceed with these puzzles. Like I didn't know that, you know, those numbers would be stuck together to create like 53 minus, uh, you know what I mean. What's going to happen now? We got the cups, we we finished here. I spent way too much time on this night. I didn't expect this puzzle to be this difficult. What now? She already did this before. Right? God. She did not like a solving a puzzle. All right, just here enjoying some tea, some some sake, and some TV. 
Oh. <sighs> Those puzzles were way too hard. She can grab my hand once I start to drink the tea. Can I have it? That's a good thing to actually ask. <laughs> uh, is that your way of saying thank you? Oh, because I fixed the cat? Those were your last two. Thank you so much for this. Just gonna grab my hand. God, that TV is very creepy. The tea she made was heartwarming. Yeah. So this isn't sake, right? Like, that doesn't look like sake to me. Tomorrow would be the last night in this room. Sad. I'm, I'm trying to, like, figure out how this um, story is going to end. And I think the way it's going to end is we end up with her, like in the afterlife, I think. Well, let's see. Okay, one final day. So you see how the, like those days were highlighted except for the first two? I think it's because on those other days that were highlighted is when I found those signs. But here we are, the final day. Oh, she, she's having a fit. Cause she knows it's the bat the, the last day. She's been like this since I got back. She keeps taking it out on the furniture. <laughs> I'm sure she knows that tomorrow this room will be demolished. Damn, she's trashing the whole place. But my guess is that she probably. Yes. There's something I really need to tell her. Oh my god. Anyway, I need her to calm down for once. Oh, my battery's dying. <gasps> no help from Sato. The battery has run out of charge. Oh no. No help. <laughs> no help, sure. I mean, I do have YouTube. <laughs> tell the truth? Huh? She knows that she's dead, yes? Okay, so we're just gonna wait for it to, to charge. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna stand here in this corner. Yeah. All I gotta do is just stand in a corner. Right? I hope this is the right thing to do. The flashlight is starting to run low. Oh my god! What?! No way! What? Why did that happen? I was... I was standing right there. We're almost there. She's lingering. Oh my god. <gasps> I, 
did it. Oh my god. I was worried that I had to go back to the phone. <laughs> I didn't want to walk anymore. But that was um that was very tense. <laughs> Finally the charge is done. Why are you so mean? Oh my god, she's gonna kill us. <gasps> That's not funny. <laughs> Did she? Hmm. As you probably know, this room will be demolished tomorrow. I probably won't see you again. Oh, is he going to invite her to like come stay at his permanent home? So now I have something very important to tell you. You're Madoka Sawaise, right? You work for the same company as I do, and stayed here at the company housing as well. And died in this room five years ago. And this is my prediction. The reason you haven't gone to heaven is not because shacking up with good-looking men. It's because you have some other regret, some unresolved issue in your life. Do you recognize it? What is? What did he find? Oh, it's a cat. It's that same cat from the beginning. Her name is Nina, and I got her from Mr. Yokoyama five years ago. Oh, that was her cat. You were Nina's original owner, weren't you? Oh, she just wanted to make sure that her cat was safe. After he passed away, Nina had nowhere else to go and was taken in by Mr. Yokoyama. But he couldn't take care of her for long. His daughter was found to be allergic to cats. Then I, who had joined the company at the right time, was given the opportunity because I had already taken care of several cats at my family's temple. Cute. Nina passed away two weeks ago. That's sad. She had an enlarged thyroid gland. It's a disease that affects a lot of older cats. She passed away peacefully in her sleep, surrounded by other cats. She had a sweet tooth, just like you. She often nibbled on the Japanese sweets I left in the living room. Nina was mourned with great care at my parents' house.
that was a lot of luck for him to figure all that out, right? Like, granted that he probably figured out that, you know, she did work for the company, but the fact that the cat was linked to the both of them, that's, uh, that's very, very lucky. <laughs> and that was it. Oh, man. Hey, guys, post-recording Migs here, and uh, we are not done with this game. Apparently, as you can see from this menu screen, we did unlock another day, day eight afternoon. So we're going to check this out here and see if we actually get a proper ending. I thought that you need to actually collect all of those um, old paper pieces that were scattered around the whole entire room. But it looks like we didn't need to collect them all, or maybe we did, and, you know, I don't know, maybe there's a whole other ending there. But fact is, we have more content, and we are going to check this out right now. Day 8, Afternoon. Everything's all packed up. A staff from the property management office and a junk dealer came and disposed of all the household goods. I really don't have a problem going home now, but I kind of helped them finish up. She hasn't been seen since last night. Alright, maybe she did move on. Go to heaven with her cat. Well, time to go. It's always those lingering shots with his hand. Huh? Oh, was he expecting her hand to grab him? I think she was. That's funny. She did it, finally. did move on. Mission Ninja checking out from the room. Okay. Why is this a mission? <laughs> this shouldn't be too difficult, right? Find a house key, find bullet train ticket, find smartphone. Okay. So we gotta find the house key. And yeah, I don't think we have to worry about her lingering haunting we just have to find the uh, items right oh bullet train ticket take this yes sir okay got the ticket Got my smartphone. Now, my key. Oh, there it is. I'm sure nothing will be forgotten now. It's time to check out. All right. Get my stuff. Look at these. There's a message on the paper. Confirm the contents. You seem to have must have understood something. I'll tell you what. It's true that Nina has been on my mind for a long, long time, but I stayed in his room because I really wanted to live together with a good-looking guy. <laughs> when you showed up as the last resident in this room, I was disappointed from the bottom of my heart. After all, my dream didn't come true until the very end. Well, these seven days were not so bad in their own way. As for Nina, I want to thank you again. Thank you for taking care of her to the end instead of me. She was very shy, and I thought she would never miss anyone but me. But in the pictures, Nina seemed to be enjoying her new environment very much. I was a little surprised that she could get along with other cats. I guess she must have been very comfortable in your home. I was a little jealous, but I was relieved that Nina seemed happy. Thank you for making Nina happy. It's time for me to leave this room. I let my wild side out during our, your stay. It's been a while since I've had my favorite sweets. I got to see Nina in that picture again. And on top of that, I was able to enjoy my life with you, even if it was only for a little while. There's no reason for me to stay here any longer. Thank you for your seven day business trip. 
Thank you for everything. Take care of yourself. There we go. She's she, she's joking, huh? She's just she's scheming. She's gonna come with us. Your admiration for good-looking men is amazing. <laughs> I think there are more important factors to consider when choosing a man than his face. For example, the ability to stay calm even when there's a ghost next to him. Is he saying that he's worthy of being her boyfriend? I mean, calm down, dude. She's dead. God, I'm like, it's all it's all too nice right now. I'm expecting the jump scare, even though it's all very pleasant. Is she gonna ascend? Ascend to heaven? Are you going already? No, she's ready to leave. Goodbye. Wait. going on I want you to have this what the hell is that dude is that like a piece of the cat's tail it's the tail hair I got from Nina's corpse. Gross. That's nasty. That's freaking disgusting. <laughs> I want you to have it. Yeah, maybe it'll, like, you know, help her find Nina in the afterlife. But still, disgusting. I will return Nina to you. Oh. I think she'd want that. Are you gonna show a ghost cat? A little ghost kitty? Don't trick him, please. That's a nice ghost story. That is an ending. Thank God that it ended that way because having it end at night seven was just too abrupt unless they were considering adding more to this experience. I like the music too. And considering that this is all made from Unity, I wonder how much of it is used with assets. Either way, it kind of just seems and feels like it's really made you know perfectly well but there you guys go that was it let's see if there's anything more i want to make sure that there, if there's anything more before i um shut this video down it's gonna bring us back to the menu screen no what's this My God, it just keeps going.
Oh, is this her in the afterlife? It is. <gasps> we get to play as her? Oh, do we get to find Nina, her cat? Yo, this game has a lot of content. I did not expect this. Oh, there she is. Oh, that's adorable. I'm not in control right now, by the way, just in case you're wondering. This is all cinematics, once again. Oh, I just realized we're in the room, but it's like on the fields of heaven. Must feel nice. Oh, and she doesn't look dirty anymore. Very good. I was hoping that it would show her looking like a lot less haggard. <laughs> you know, she deserves to look pretty at the end. Brilliant. Very good. Well, there you guys have it. That was Seven Nights Ghost. And thank God that this ended in a way where it, it expanded on the ending here. It even did more than what was expected here. I mean, um, I had thought originally that it just ended with uh, the seventh night and that was it. And I was like, no, yo, yo, that was way too abrupt. I mean, did I miss something? Maybe I had to collect more of those uh, little paper pieces around the... Uh, the apartment around the room but it looks like it gave it to us you know no matter what or maybe you just had to collect a certain amount in order to unlock that ending i don't know but i am very glad to have unlocked that ending it was very good very pleasant it was well deserved especially not only for the characters but for the player himself because you know this game was not easy you know sure it was easy at first with some of the minimal puzzles but as the week progressed um, as you had seen you know with today's video it got a lot tougher i mean there were certain puzzles here where i i, I may have checked out a video or two uh, I, I won't tell you guys i won't tell but i will say that overall this experience was really good really well thought out and I enjoyed the hell out of it. So there you guys have it. That was Seven Nights Ghost. Let me know in the comments what you thought of this whole experience. Um, have you yourself played this? Have you unlocked every sin single landing? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, if you would like to see me try to get other endings, also let me know and I will gladly um, show off a video of, of that as well otherwise we're going to end it right here um also if you want to check this game out for yourself be sure to check the link in the description down below that will lead you straight to the game page and please support this developer but until then Again, I want to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, please do not forget to leave a like. And if you're new to the channel, please do consider subscribing as well as ring the bell so that you are notified for the next video. And that's going to be it for today. I want to thank you all so much again for watching. My name is MigsXL and I will see you in the next video.